Next, we consider a news vendor that applies nonlinear probability weighting. The concept of nonlinear probability weighting is a bit different than the behavioral concepts we applied before. The difference here is that a news vendor who applies nonlinear probability weighting in some sense still tries to maximize the expected profit, but her expectations are not based on the real or objective probabilities, but on subjective probabilities. So here we consider a news vendor that applies nonlinear probability weighting. For the news vendor, a probability of p feels like w of p. And here, in this special case, w of p is defined as the square root of p divided by the square root of p plus the square root of 1 minus p squared. So now we want to calculate the expected utility of this news vendor when ordering 13 units. The first step is as before, but with one difference. So we consider a news vendor ordering 13 units with a probability of 0.3. This news vendor faces a demand of 10 units. However, note the difference here. We do not plug in 0.3, but we take W of 0.3, because for this news vendor, the probability of 0.3 feels like a different probability. So we have W of 0.3 times the profit that is gained in this case. So in this case, the news vendor sells 10 units at a price of 10 and has expenses of 13 times 4. With a probability of 0.5, the news vendor faces a demand of 12. Again, we do not, we cannot write down 0.5, but have to take W of 0.5 and take the profit in this case. In this case, the demand is 12. So the news vendor is selling 12 units at a price of 10 and bought 13 units at a price of 4. Finally, with a probability of 0.2, the news vendor can sell all 13 units. So we write down W of 0.2 times the profit, and this is 13 times 10 minus 13 times 4. So let us simplify this expression. This is w of 0.3 times 100 minus 13 times 4. 13 times 4 is 52, so this is just 48 plus W of 0.5 times 120 minus 52, which is 68. And finally, W of 0.2 times 130 minus 52 which is 78. So now we have to calculate the subjective probabilities. So W of 0.3 is equal to the square root of 0.3 divided by the square root of 0.3 plus the square root of 0.7 squared and this is about this is about 0 
two, eight, six. So for this news vendor, a probability of 30% feels like a probability of 28.6%. A probability of 20% feels like square root of 0.2, square root of 0.2 plus square root of 0.8 squared is equal to, which is approximately 24 point nine percent so as you can see the probability of 30 percent feels like a probability of 28.6 percent instead of this a probability of 20 percent feels like a probability of almost 25 percent so finally we have to plug in the or we have to calculate the subjective probability of um, 0.5 or the equivalent to it so w of 0.5 is equal to the square root of 0.5 divided by the square root of 0.5 plus the square root of 0.5 squared and this is this is approximately 0.35 Four. All right, and if we now plug in the values we've calculated for the Ws or for the subjective probabilities, we find that the news vendor has an expected utility of about approximately 58.1% nine so as you've seen when calculating the expected utility of a news vendor who applies nonlinear probability weighting the key point is to calculate the subjective probabilities